The official Doctor Who YouTube channel released a teaser trailer for the next Doctor Who story that is going to be fully animated and released on DVD, Blu-ray, and Steelbook in 2020. It is none other than Doctor Who The Faceless Ones. How cool is that? You can pre-order this release by using the links in the description down below and in the card up above. You can also always check out my Amazon list of every single second Doctor DVD, Blu-ray, and Steelbook. This list will be constantly updated and always shows you the latest Amazon prices for all of the second Doctor DVDs, Blu-rays, and Steelbooks at a glance, and it supports the channel if you check out that page and buy anything on Amazon. It's linked in the description down below. This is exciting news for Second Doctor fans, for fans of Jamie, Ben, and Polly, so let's talk about that more today on the Doctor Who Guide. The best box set that you can buy for Doctor Who. Hello and welcome back to the Doctor Who Guide, a community of fans helping each other grow their knowledge collection and connection with other Doctor Who fans. I'm just your host Alex Patterson and today we are talking about the Faceless Ones animation. I do want to give a shout out to Doctor Who, whose video was the very first way that I found out about this release. The teaser trailer for this release just came out and you can watch it in the card up above and linked in the description down below. The teaser confirmed that sometime in 2020 we will get the Faceless Ones on DVD, Blue Blu-ray and Steelbook, and it linked to a Doctor Who.TV article that gave us a little bit more information, although not much more than what the trailer told us. According to this article, all six episodes of The Faceless Ones will be animated in color. Now after reading that, two things spring to mind. First off, all six episodes? There were only four missing episodes from this story, episodes two, four, five, and six. Now episodes one and three are surviving, but I suppose they wanted to animate all six just so you'd have a more consistent viewing experience. I hope the the fact that they are animating two episodes and nobody was asking them to animate is a sign that they'll be more ambitious with future projects? Surely that comes closer to the amount of work that some of the shorter episodes or stories with less episodes to animate that haven't been animated now would take to be animated? That's a confusing sentence. The second thing that jumps out to me is that they don't mention a black and white version of this story. I don't really think that anybody needs to be worried about that. Based off of the releases of The Power of the Daleks and The Macro Terror, those releases had not only color versions but also black and white versions as well as audio versions and the surviving clips with reconstruction versions and all that so I'm certain that we will get everything there is to watch or listen to from the Faceless Ones on this new release. Now all this excitement about the Faceless Ones coming out has had me thinking about what the collection will look like once we have that DVD on the shelves and what release could come out next that would give us the most consecutive DVDs on the shelf. So of course I made a spreadsheet to help me visualize all of these thoughts. The stories in red have missing episodes. This is their story number column. If you see a story in orange, that means it hasn't yet had a DVD release of its own. Stories in blue are individual DVD releases where a story has been completed with animation, but the surrounding episodes are in video. It's only the missing episodes that have been animated. Stories in yellow are completely animated. If we were to get uh, the Highlanders, animated we would have all of the individual DVD releases for stories 29 to 35. Obviously The Underwater Menace hasn't been completed with animation. It would be nice to have a special edition maybe that comes out with the episodes animated. It'd be great to have The Smugglers animated as well as The Highlanders because then we would have all the Ben and Polly stories. Uh, if The Evil of the Daleks and The Smugglers and The Highlanders were all animated then all of season 4 would be animated as well. Obviously season 3 has a lot more DVDs to go but it would be very Cool to have any of these, uh, especially the Daleks Master Plan animated. If we got Marco Polo animated or the Crusade animated, they would complete their seasons. If we organize all the stories that haven't yet had individual DVD releases by the amount of episodes left to animate, uh, we can sort of get an idea um, based on the number of episodes how easy or hard an episode is. Now, obviously, we've seen that a story could, like the Phasis ones that has six episodes and two of them unnecessary to animate, could all be animated and still be an easier prospect than some of these shorter episodes which may have more characters or just would be harder to animate. Let me know which ones you want to see come out the most next and which ones you think are most likely because those can often be two different things. Now I want to point out for fans in the US and Canada we still haven't even gotten the Macra Terror release. That's coming out in October and unless you happen to be lucky enough to know people like William who send you the Macra Terror Region 2 DVD plus a Region 2 DVD player you're stuck with not being able to 
even see this latest release. So I imagine that's quite frustrating. By the way, I've heard great things about zoom.co.uk. They really are sort of an underdog seller. You can pretty much always get 10% off their orders by using the code SIGNUP10. I haven't personally used them, but I've heard glowing reviews of their delivery time. As well as a site called Zavi. Comment down below with any other alternative sites or collecting tips that you have for people who are looking to pre-order or buy the faceless ones. You can click or tap right here to watch the official Doctor Who teaser trailer for the faceless ones. You can click or tap this round icon to subscribe because we have new videos coming out every single Saturday and you can click or tap the square icon to check out my complete and updated lists of all of the second Doctor UK and US Doctor Who DVDs on Amazon. Thank you so much for watching. Bye!